New at five, giving machines are now at the Tulsa Gathering Place and will soon open to the public just tomorrow. Yeah, we've told you giving machines are just like vending machines that allow you to donate supplies to local charities. Fox 23's Jade Morrow is live at Gathering Place. And Jade, these machines have now been around the country for a while. That's right, Shay. These giving machines were a concept that started back in 2017, and now they're in Tulsa. Now, these are the vending machines that are behind me, and how they work is that you'll choose whatever item. And so, for example, if I wanted to choose nourishing snacks, I'd have to put in the code 110 on the machine, and you'll be able to donate that to whatever nonprofit that it is nonprofit organization of your choice. Now the unique vending machines were made to serve as an easy act of service, a way for anyone to go and donate to a local or global charity. Now Giving Machines is partnered with five local charities and two global charities. And these are, there are cards with different items on them that range in price from $10 to $250. And they have items like coats, a baby stroller, holiday meals, and even goats in a beehive. Now I spoke to the director of Giving Machines, Mike Grass, and he told me Tulsa is now one of the the 106 locations to participate in their mission and he also said to see something start off so small and to something so big across the country it's truly amazing to see. I never thought it would get to this point. It really started small and the fact that so many locations are raising, the, raising their hand to host a giving machine, it's also fun to see the impact it's made on the communities. So when you buy a soccer ball, when you're buying shoes, when you're buying foodstuffs, they go right into those charities' hands at the time that they need the most. Now, these giving machines are located just outside of Williams Lodge tomorrow morning. Now, coming up, I spoke to a few people who had no idea what the giving machines were or anything about them. But now, after speaking with them, they said that they're, it's definitely something they're going to have to come and check out. And I'm working on that for our Fox 23 News at 6. Live in Tulsa, covering news that matters, I'm Jade Morrow, Fox 23 News. Those giving machines will be a gathering place through December 2nd.